Hey guys, what's up? On our previous episode, we made a video about the signs of burnout and burnout is a serious condition that everyone should take note of. Today, we will be giving you tips on how to avoid burnout. But before we do, you know what to do, like, subscribe, and gong that bell. Well, that's normal, but once you have it, don't forget that it is a serious condition that you should not just ignore. For ignoring it, it will pile up on you and it will have a really bad toll on your body. You will need to assess how to move forward with it so that you will not be consumed by burnout. So in order for us to combat this, let's get the show started on Freedom Quick Tips. Number one is reassess yourself and get the basics in check. So what are the basics you might be wondering? You'll need to exercise so that your body can remove the toxins and stress from itself. Sleeping is another basic factor that you will need to cover. Guys, sleeping helps you regulate your body. It repairs the cells that you use in everyday life. Sleeping helps you get your batteries up and running. Number two is go out, go to the beach, visit mountain ranges, go to places where Wi-Fi is not available. Okay, so we all know that one way to get those pesky stress monsters away from you is to completely distance yourself from it. Well, have you ever heard of taking a vacation? Well, you will need it every once in a while because if you just wallow around your content creation, it will just gnaw in your system and before you knew it, burnout has you within its grasp. Number three is think positive, do positive, be positive. So okay, it's harder than you think, but hey, it's always a good idea to think positively about your surroundings, about yourself, and the things you have accomplished thus far. I know now that the negativity is sinking in, and it's so hard to think about the positive things in life. Trust me, I'm a pessimistic person out of habit, and the negative things are the things that always sticks to our minds. The positive ones sometimes are forgotten and taken for granted, but if you let those positive feelings fill you up, then you might have a chance to combat burnout. Number four is go out with your friends. You guys have friends, right? Well, you can ask those closest to you to get out of town a few days and just relax. Maybe for you guys to go to some province and watch the stars, or maybe go somewhere your office mates won't be able to bug you, or that constant gnawing on your shoulders about your deadlines. Which reminds me, I need to make another video, ugh. I need a vacation, guys. Also guys, do you know those negative people who puts you even more under when you're having a bad day? Yep, I'm looking at you, negative people. Hope you'll stop being negative one day. When we're having burnout, it's better if we limit talking to them because it's not healthy for us to talk to people who will just put us down even further on our darkest days. Number five is eat a healthy diet. Yeah, I'm looking at you, 20-year-old me. Even up until now, I still do that. French fries, soft drinks, and all those high sugar and carb drinks. So now I'm kind of paying the price and I'm trying to lessen or refrain from consuming food or drinks that adversely affect my mood. Like coffee, trans fat, and other preservatives. Instead, eat food that offers omega-3 fatty acid. You know what I'm talking about, guys. You know what I'm talking about. Eat fish. Salmon, herring, mackerel, anchovies, sardines, seaweed, flax seeds, and walnuts. Oh my god, man. I, I really love salmon. Number six is get off your chair and do exercise. Yep, it's one of the things that we all hate but must do. Exercise. Well, honestly, if you exercise, maybe do a little jog around your house or do a little push-ups, it kind of lightens your mood. Try to lift some weights, pursue another hobby like basketball or volleyball, or if you're brave enough, try rugby. Football with no armor, a tackle from your foes will definitely knock out the burnout out of your system. If that doesn't ask the condition, I don't know what will. Honestly, one tackle from a rampaging dude will even get your socks off of your feet. And that's the episode, guys. Those are the things you can do to counteract burnout. If you have other techniques or remedies, let us know down below. Do you have a friend who is in the burnout stage? You can share this to them so that you can save them from a miserable condition. This will really help them out, guys. Before you leave, guys, you know what to do. Leave a like, subscribe, and gong that bell. My name is Nold, guys, bringing you tips on how to grow your channel. Always remember, freedom, quick tips. I'll be seeing you guys on the next episode. Goodbye.